YouTubers, Mandarins, I don't know what to call you guys. Leave some names down below, that'd be cool, let's come up with something. Yeah, let's do it. Anyways, today's video is going to be very interesting. I'm going to be showing you guys my favorite products of all time, and they all happen to be vegan, which is really awesome. They're all cruelty free, all their ingredients are super nice. They actually don't have crap in them that most products have in the grocery stores or Walmart. These are all natural products that have all natural ingredients, so I'm really in love with all these. Disclaimer, I'm not paid to say any of this. This is 100% my opinion. I love these products with all my heart. I use them every single day and they're just so freaking awesome and I just really wanted to tell you guys because I feel like a lot of people don't know about these products so if I say it to you guys then you guys will know about this and then you guys can have vegan products like me and then if you guys share this video tell other people about it more people can have vegan products and then we could all just be a bunch of twins with vegan products so yeah that'd be really awesome. Let's just get started because there's so much stuff that I have. I hope this video doesn't end up being 20 minutes and if it is Get some popcorn and let's get started. <laughs> the first brand I'm going to be talking about is Own Beauty. They are gluten free, they are non GMO, they are Leaping Bunny certified and vegan. Certified vegan. So that's awesome. All these products that I'm going to tell you are vegan, like I said before. So if I mentioned they're vegan, you guys already know that. The first product they have is their facial wipes and these facial wipes save me tons of time in the morning especially because I'm a really lazy person this will save me time when I'm like in college or I'm going to class you know and I just need to clean my face really quick these wipes are super super convenient so I really recommend these the own skin health rejuvenating cleanser it has the same scent as all its other products the way it makes your skin feel is really nice I feel like it's better to take care of your skin now than later when it's already gone through so many problems and stuff another product I have from them is their dual protecting day lotion and I really love this because it has SPF 30. You don't want any sunspots or premature aging. I really love this. It's nice and thick but it absorbs really quickly in your skin so I really recommend this product too. My last product from them is their Renewing Refining Moisture Night Cream. I really love this night cream. It has a really thick consistency. It doesn't have like a flowery or like oh like that kind of smell like oh my god so good. It's just a plain smell. It doesn't smell bad by all means. Another brand I will be showing you is one of my favorites that I'm going to be showing you. Skin Dressing. They are USDA certified organic and of course they are vegan and cruelty free so that is a huge huge plus. One of the first ingredients I have of them is their Skin Refresher and this feels so nice on your face and it has exotic plant essences so you know you're going to be putting good things on your face you'll see that gold is like their thing so yeah the skin refresher is really nice i really love this another thing that i love is their skin serum it has rose and cucumber essences and the exotic plant essences as well it feels really soft on your face and it absorbs right away and all their products smell really really nice another thing that i have from them is their vitamin e and tea tree face soap this thing is gold. I'm not just talking about the packaging that it looks like a bar of gold. This thing is really nice. Feels like a soapy, buttery consistency and it just cleans my skin really nicely and then afterwards when I rinse my face it feels so, so smooth and I really highly recommend this. My all-time favorite thing from them is their Ultimate Rose Butter. This thing is liquid gold. It looks like liquid gold. Oh my god, and it's just super, super nice. I keep on saying super, super and so, so, but it's because it's true. They need 20 dozen distilled roses to get the oil to make this. I use it as a moisturizer sometimes and it's just super moisturizing. If Even if you have eczema or super dry skin, this will really help. I really love using this one at night. Another brand I will be showing you guys is a Yobi. They use no water at all. It's 100% concentrated products. It uses no preservatives. It's all pure 100% ingredients. It's paraben free, talc free, and it's vegan like everything here. <laughs> it's Leaping Bunny certified and it's also biodegradable. So I really love these. Their butters are insanely, insanely moisturizing. The vanilla smells godly. It smells so good. The regular butter smells super good as well. They both have different consistencies. The regular Yovi butter is more of a liquid and the Yovi butter in vanilla is more of, you know, a solid consistency. But they both apply the same way. They both feel the same way on my skin. Another cool thing about this glass jar is it's reusable. So I really love that about their packaging. Their lip butters are super moisturizing. I have their tinted lip butter. My favorite lip butter from them is their mint chocolate. This one tastes so good. I love it. Another chapstick company that I've been loving is Hoorah! Hoorah has some of the best chapsticks 
on earth. Not even joking. I'm serious. Hoorah is premium organic. It's vegan like everything. It uses all raw ingredients and it's fair trade so that's really awesome. I have their lime lip balm which tastes like a lime Jolly Rancher. I also have their blue chamomile vanilla which is my favorite. I also have their black cherry tinted lip balm and unlike the other ones this is the only one that's tinted and it tastes really good too. And I also have their chai spice. Oh, they're all so so good. This is a brand that a lot of YouTubers talk about, a lot of people know about it, and it's Lush. Lush of course is vegan, cruelty free, they're handmade, which I really love about them, and they use fresh ingredients. And 100% of the purchase price, which means like, you know, every penny, excluding the taxes, they go towards humanitarian, environmental, and animal rights locally. I love Lush, and I just really like that they do that. If you guys watch Just Like That, Maddie, she has this. When I bought this, she told me, oh, you're gonna love it. So, she was right. I I love this dry shampoo and it smells like citrus or lime so I really love the scent and leaves afterwards. This is a sample. It's the Mask of Magramint. I leave it on for like five minutes until like it dries and then I rinse it off and it feels so nice on my skin and it smells insanely good. Another thing I love by them is their moisturizer Imperialis. This actually doesn't make me break out. This absorbs really nicely in my skin. It doesn't have like a super floral or fruity scent. It's kind of plain just like the own products. So I really love this moisturizer and I can't wait to buy another one after I'm done because I just love this moisturizer so much. My favorite thing from them is the Angels on Bare Skin. This cleanser it smells so good and you could use it on your body too. Oh, it smells insanely good. I love using this cleanser. It's one of my favorites and it leaves my skin feeling so good so I really love this. Okay, let's talk about deodorant. Deodorant is one of my BFFs. I'm going to show you guys two different deodorant companies. Schmitz Deodorant. I really love the name by the way, Schmitz. And I just love how it's packaged. They're in glass jars and the deodorant is really thick and they come with these little metal spatulas so you could just scoop it out, put it on your fingers, get it warm and then you just apply it on your pits. It's all natural, cruelty free and it's partnered with the Humane Society so I really love that about Schmitz. So this is their lavender sage deodorant. I also have fragrance free if I don't want any scent under there. And my favorite is their Bergamo, I don't know, I don't know if I'm saying it right, bergamot, lime. It smells like a margarita. Mm. So the Schmitz deodorant is really nice and the scent actually lasts and it doesn't leave a white cast. This is a really nice company and I really love their deodorants. And another company I'm gonna be showing you guys is Caitlyn Supernatural. I love this deodorant and what is super unique about it is that it's in spray form. You just get the deodorant, shake it up, and ah. It's like a perfume for your pits. About Caitlyn's deodorant, it uses 100% botanical ingredients. It's organic, probiotic, paraben free, it's aluminum free, artificial fragrance, fragrance free, <laughs> and it donates 2% of all its profits to water.org and it also supports a non-profit meditation retreat center. So this deodorant is really nice and they come in glass bottles. They're really nicely packaged. I have two scrubs I'm going to be showing you guys. One of the companies is Dirt Tea. This company is insane. Their teas smell insanely insanely good. You're gonna want to take a shower like five times a day and ju just to use these. I have the original which I've used. I you have the diamond and I have the chai coconut. It's all organic. It's US based. It's cruelty free and what I love about scrubs is it combats scars and acne so you can really scrub this on your face and if you have really bad acne scars this will really help. It's phosphate free, gluten free, chemical preservative free. <laughs> the portion of the profits off this company go to clean water action. The second company of scrubs that I'm going to be showing you is the Mr. Bean Coffee Scrub. If you have an Instagram, if you have a Twitter, everything, you know that coffee scrubs are super hipster and everyone has it. it smells insanely, insanely good. I don't really drink coffee a lot, but I will scrub coffee on my body any day. Oh yes. So about Mr. Bean, it's organic, fair trade, cruelty free, and of course, vegan. If you guys are wondering what are the benefits of scrubs, like why do people do it? The caffeine in this helps with cellulite. It also helps with age spots, um, varicose vein, it helps with eczema, it also helps with psoriasis, blackheads, breakouts, and any other skin blemishes on your face. And it smells insanely, insanely good, and I'm not exaggerating. I have the Mandarin. They have a set called Mandarin. Isn't that awesome? Now I'm gonna be showing you guys wipes, because who doesn't love being lazy? 
I love being lazy. These wipes are by La Fresh Eco Beauty, and I have so many of them. They're just super convenient to me. I really love them. I really love using the waterproof makeup remover. It's really easy to take off my makeup with this. After taking off my makeup, I'll go in with their oil-free face cleanser wipe. If I'm too lazy to wash my face, I'm not going to stop at taking off my makeup. I'm actually going to clean my face with these face cleanser wipes. And I feel like if you're on the road or if you're coming back really late at night, you just don't have the energy to take off your makeup and go through your entire night routine. This is really nice to clean your face and it takes off any of the excess makeup that your other wipe didn't take off. Instant cooling body soother wipes. Sorry, that's a long definition of these wipes. <laughs> I wipe it all over my skin. It leaves it with a cooling sensation. It feels really nice. If you're feeling really stressed, you can just pull out one of these wipes, wipe it all over your body, like maybe your neck and your shoulders, and it leaves it feeling really, really nice. So I really love these wipes. And I also love their nail polish remover wipes and it's acetone free. So it doesn't have that super strong smell that a lot of nail polish removers have. It takes off my nail polish really easily. Does this ever happen to you guys? Like you put nail polish in your nails and it lasts like maybe a month or so and then you put it on your toes and it lasts like for five billion years. <laughs> That's how my toes are. So I thought it was going to be really difficult to take off this nail polish since it's been there for such a long time, but this nail remover took it off. Nail remover? Nail polish remover took it off really easily, so I really love this. Law Fresh uses very little, little water to make their products because, like I said before, fresh water is scarce, so I really love that about them. Going into body care and face cleansers are these cognac sponges. My cognac sponges are really, really nice. What's different about these sponges to regular sponges is they're really soft, really gentle exfoliator, so you could use this around your eyes and it won't tug it, it won't make it feel all scratchy. I really love using this sponge. They come out hard, but when you get it wet, it's super spongy. I have their green one, I have their regular ones, I have their black one, I have their red one, and I also have their pink ones. I'm gonna be switching out these sponges every three months and they're super amazing. I really highly recommend it. And about my cognac sponge, they're made by 100% food grade cognac powder. They use no artificial colors. They are paraben free, talc free, and of course they are vegan. They're Leaping Bunny certified and they're biodegradable. So I really love these sponges now we can get into makeup so this is gonna be interesting one of my favorite makeup powders I've ever used in my life and I'm starting to like this better than my Laura Mercier powder and you guys know how obsessed I am with that I'm talking about everyday minerals let me just talk about their face powder right now I use it under my eyes to set my concealer and stuff what's different about this compared to the Laura Mercier powder is this doesn't leave a white cast on your face I don't know if it sinks into my skin but my skin looks so natural there's no white cast at all i really recommend this powder i also love their base powder this color matches me perfectly i have golden tan in 5w it's matte it doesn't leave it super super matte it leaves it a little bit dewy a little bit natural and i really love this powder for it i also love their blush i have primrose what i love about it so much is it's a light pink so when i apply it even if i apply too much it looks really really natural this blush is freaking heaven i really like it and they sell brushes some of the best brushes i've ever used in my life i have their little dome brush and i use this for contouring and it's really nice this one is such a good quality of course it's vegan and I just really love it to apply my bronzer to add any contour so I really love this and I really really love their flat top brush I use this to apply my powder and it applies it evenly it's so so soft and it applies such good coverage so I highly recommend these brushes they're so nice and they're such good quality and about everyday minerals they are vegan cruelty free handmade and they have recyclable packaging which is really nice because who doesn't like to recycle Another makeup brand I'm going to be showing you guys is O Natural Cosmetics. They have such high quality makeup, I can't believe that not a lot of people use it. I've never seen other YouTubers use this makeup before, so I just feel like I've hit a really big gem. I have their Cali Powder Foundation, and I got this in a darker color, which sucks. I'm not an expert sometimes in picking out my colors. This foundation has such high coverage and it's really nice and it's really blendable, super soft. It leaves my skin feeling really smooth. So I definitely want to order this in a lighter color. I used this with my dome brush from Everyday Minerals and I just blended it to the natural areas of my face where there should be a bronze or a contour. It leaves such a natural bronze. I highly recommend this foundation. My favorite thing I think from them is their highlighter. This um, highlighter is in Begonia, and when you first open it, you would think that this is like a pink highlighter, but when you apply it on your skin, it's kind of golden. Such a nice highlighter. Definitely one of my favorite highlighters that I have. I love it better than my MAC highlighter. I love it better than my Urban Decay Naked highlighter. This highlighter is insanely nice. I highly, highly recommend it. I also have one of their eyeshadows in tobacco, and I don't have any colors like this. It's like a deep 
brown copper color kind of like a burnt orange undertone to it and I really love it for the crease super super pigmented I can't even explain it to you guys and it's very very blendable I also have these little stick things and they look exactly the same so you would think this is like the exact same type of product but one of them is a foundation, the other one is a bronzer. This foundation is in Mallorca, and this matches my skin perfectly. And I mean perfectly. I used it today on my skin, and it's very smooth, and it's very creamy. So I just apply it all over my face. I put it under my eyes, I put it around my nose where I have any redness. I put it over blemishes. And then I'll either just spread it out with my fingers if I want more of a coverage, or if I'm like in a rush and I want it to blend out faster, I'll use my beauty blender. With this underneath, I'll apply my powder foundations over it and it doesn't look heavy at all. This is their bronzer and they only have one cream bronzer. And I really, really love it. And it has a little bit of shimmer in it, but when you apply it on your face, the shimmer isn't super drastic. It leaves more of a dewy look, and I really, really love it. It's super, super creamy, just like the foundation. I used it on my face today, and I love it so much. And I also have a brush from them, and just like Everyday Minerals, this brush is one of the best ones I've ever used in my life, ever. <laughs> As you can tell, it's like a really nice quality, super nice, super smooth. I think they sold this for their powder foundations, but I've really been loving this for my liquid foundations. You guys shouldn't be obsessed with this brush. It's so, so nice. These are the best brushes ever yes another company is geek chic cosmetics and this is one of my favorite companies I'm gonna be showing you guys because it's so unique and you can definitely tell it's handmade geek chic cosmetics is hundred percent cruelty free and what I love about it is each eyeshadow is based off their geeky obsessions so I don't know all of them if you guys know any of these inspirations then comment them down below this first eyeshadow I'm gonna be showing you is called moon prism power makeup this eyeshadow is really really nice it's a cute pinky color and all these eyeshadows have some shimmer in it the pigmentation in all these eyeshadows is insane. It's one of the best pigmentations I've ever used in any eyeshadow. These eyeshadows are very affordable, like very, very affordable, and the pigmentation is so good. And the next eyeshadow I'm gonna be showing you is single player. I have no idea what it's based off of. It's another pink eyeshadow. It's definitely lighter than the first one I showed you. So I really love this one as well. The next eyeshadow is called Fellowship. It has these two statues on the front, but I have no idea what it's based on such a pretty silver shadow so i cannot wait to make like a smoky eye and put this like maybe a little bit on my lid such a beautiful color the next color i'm going to be showing you guys is color of the month august 2015 a very shimmery taupe color and it has such a pretty girl in the front i have no idea what it's based on but like i said before if you guys know what these eyeshadows are based on then comment down below because i'm very interested <laughs> this next one has like the sun thing and it has a star in the middle and this one is called super neutrals this is just multi-purpose glitter so you can um, get your brush a little bit wet get some of this glitter and then apply it on any eye look that you're doing if you want more of a glam to it this one i am pretty sure is based off the hunger games oh yeah it's definitely from the hunger games it's called ever in your favor a super brown sparkly eyeshadow honestly i think like these swatches don't really give these eyeshadows justice i feel like you really need to get them and see them in person to see how awesome they are the last eyeshadow i'm gonna be showing you guys is definitely based off of harry potter it's called witchcraft and wizardry it's like a light super light taupe brown with tons of shimmer in it these are the eyeshadows i have of them i have tons because I just love their eyeshadows so much. And I also have two lippies off of them. And I just want to say I really love the packaging. I have a pink one. And this one leaves literally the prettiest Barbie pink on your lips. And I also have this blue one. And I really love a blue lipstick because I would love to experiment. And I really love the names too. The pink one is called Psychomagnetheric Ectoplasm. Very smart name if anyone ever asks you what you're wearing on your lips. And the blue one is called Time and Relative Dimension in Space. These lippies just sound super smart and they're going to make you feel super smart just wearing them on your lips. And this is literally one of my favorite things I'm going to be showing you guys. The Axiology Lipsticks are insanely insanely good one of my favorite lipsticks i ever had and the packaging is insane i've never seen anything like this axiology is chemical and synthetic free they're packaged with recyclable paper to see the packaging i could just tell that this was going to be such a good lipstick i've never seen anything packaged like this before so this is 100 percent recyclable paper and it donates six percent of all its profits to the orangutan foundation it makes me really happy knowing that so many companies actually 
give away their profits and donate to all these really great charities. I have two colors from them. I have Dimension. It's like a super light brown with tons of gold flecks in it. It leaves your lips with the gnarliest ombre ever. When I wear it, people think I'm wearing an ombre. It leaves it with a brown goldy color. It's so natural. It makes it look really, really cool. And I also have this color bad and I posted a selfie wearing this. It's a deep dark red and I feel like it has like a brown undertone to it. Such a nice fall color so I'm going to be really excited to use these. These lipsticks are super creamy. They actually stay on your lips and I just really love them. So I really recommend these lipsticks. I think the last thing I'm going to be showing you guys is this all natural vegan concealer by the all natural face so about the all natural face no artificial ingredients it's top free paraben free and of course it is vegan i really wish this concealer was my color because if it wasn't my color this would honestly be the best powder concealer ever since it's super super light i just use it to highlight my face like i'll use it under my eyes i'll use it on the bridge of my nose i'll use it under my eyebrows and it leaves the most natural highlight you could ever think of the pigmentation of this powder is insane they have such a wide variety of products on their website so definitely go check them out I only have one makeup product from them so I definitely want to go and buy more I really love using this when I want more of a natural highlight so yeah love this concealer okay you guys and I think that was everything yay that took so long I am so sorry I just wanted to show you guys that there's more out there than going to your local drugstore I'm really happy to show these products to you guys because I'm loving them so much and I really want you guys to try them out because you're really helping a really good cause when you try out vegan cruelty free products you're not contributing to companies that do so much harm to animals and I know a lot of people don't care about animals and they don't care if they get hurt or get tested on but that's them and I respect them but I just want other people to know that there's so much good makeup out there and it doesn't have to be tested on animals to be good so definitely check out these companies down below there's so many more companies out there so definitely if I do find another company that I love I'll be including it in a future video. If you have any questions, I'll be sure to answer them. I will answer literally every single question that I get. Make sure you comment, leave your love, follow me on any of my social media. If you tweet me on Twitter, 100% of the time, I'll tweet you back. If you comment on my Instagram photos, I'll comment back to you 80% of the time. Sometimes I don't comment back and that's because there's just so many comments and I can't get back to every single person. If your Instagram isn't on private, I usually go onto people's Instagrams that comment on my photos and I'll usually comment on your photos too. Make sure you follow me on any of my social media. I would love to talk to you guys and be more personal. So yeah, that was everything and without further ado, I'm gonna say goodbye. <laughs> but yeah, love you guys. Bye!